Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Lois Jane and for today I have this beautiful grungy dark glitter I don't even know kind of look and this is in collaboration with a bunch of beautiful beautiful women I will leave all their links down below. They all have different types of looks that they're doing This is just like a collaboration. We're all showing our talent. I'm gonna put their links down below You can check their channels out most of them. I think are in Spanish But um, yeah, you can check them out anyways If you're brand new you already know what to do. My name is Lois Jane Subscribe down to my channel so you can make this a wonderful family girl girl. We are growing We are slowly but surely growing thumbs up on this video comment down below leave a comment down below guys it helps me out so much knowing if you like this video if you don't all of that so before i chat your ear away let's get on to the video i'm gonna use that pink right there and that is gonna be my first color and do you guys see how like how much pigmentation that shows every time i see your phone love these brushes also guys these brushes are really cheap like um i think they're i don't know they're very affordable though they're they're really good and they show off a lot of color like they pack on colors this is what i use on all my clients now because my other brushes aren't as good they're so good that i ordered some for my friend for valentine's day so i really hope she likes them so i'm gonna keep packing that color on you already know until we get that perfect darkness that you want but i'm gonna grab another brush another blending brush and i'm gonna grab a red and this one is from the morphe palette as well i'm gonna put that right under kind of and blend as i go And that is uh, so pretty, but we want a little bit more of like a red. So I'm gonna go into the Beige Cosmetics Red and do the eye, and that is uh, so much brighter. Now I'm gonna grab another brush. This is another blending brush, and I'm gonna grab that red from the Morphe 35B and add a little bit of the purple. And I'm gonna put that right where I'm gonna cut my crease. If you have like a darker red, um, like a burgundy, I don't really have one. You can just use that, but you know, mixing colors is also allowed to make the shades that you need. Oh, and I'm blending, guys, I'm sorry. I'm blending everything out with this brush. Okay, now I'm going to cut my crease. And what I use is the Tarte Tape Shape, as always. Put some on the back of my hand like this. And I just cut my crease. Um, I'm going to do this off camera. So the video doesn't turn out crazy long. And I also get really nervous cutting my crease. So I like to pay attention to when I'm cutting my crease. Just for a simple fact that... I want that sharp line, but I'm going to use this uh, brush right here. Oh, my Sorry, guys, my fingers are all dirty. But this brush right here, and this is a BH Cosmetics. Uh, it doesn't even have a number, but it's like from this brush. Uh, this brush set. Okay, so this is why I hate doing cut creases because I could never get the eye shape right. But this is what I have, so we're going to go with it. And this is the color Mani. And I'm just getting it, I'm picking it up with a flip. Hey guys, real quick, um, I forgot to mention what palette this is. This is the Pro Etienne palette from Per Cosmetics. So just wanted to add that real quick. Yeah. Bye. That brush, putting that all over here. And it's so pigmented, guys. Like, seriously. We're gonna grab the brush that, that we use a little red with. I'm gonna grab more of that red from the 35B palette and I'm gonna put that right here. Kind of in the middle. Just preparing it for the shade that I'm about to put. Her Cosmetics, they have these cute little, I don't even know what these are called guys because I have I don't have the 
the box it came in but these are like these little shimmer shadows you've seen me use these i'm gonna use namaste and a lust together and i'm gonna put that on the back of my hands this is the shade namaste the darker one right there and I'm, i mean this is the shade lust actually and i'm gonna mix that with namaste which is like a pinker right there and i'm gonna mix those two with a flat brush and i'm gonna put that on the middle of the eye like that so pretty. So, so pretty just make sure you have a lot on so now i'm gonna go back in with that mani shade that i showed you guys and i'm gonna mix it with the bossy shade and i'm just gonna blend out like that corner right there to make it look less like rough but i'm also gonna bring in the dark color that i'm adding on right now to kind of make it look like the glitter is fading out kind of i'm gonna mix 3 a.m and galaxy and the reason why you're probably like they look exactly the same they actually don't this is more like a grayish color and i'm extra as hell so i'm just mixing both and what we're gonna start doing is adding it really really slow to the eye kind of patting motions because it's really pigmented and we don't want it to like overpower the eye or get rid of all that red and i'm blending as i go guys okay so now that we have both eyes looking recently don't worry about all this mess right here because honestly i'm over it but i'm gonna grab a dark black and i'm just gonna put that really tight close to my waterline or eyelash line sorry and i'm gonna put that right there with potting motions into the lash line and this is just gonna give it like a smoked out effect pretty much it for the eye look i'm gonna do my face off camera and the rest of the eye after i do my face okay so i know i said i was gonna do my face off camera and i am but i just wanted to um give the um primer that i used on my last video a second chance for a simple fact that i did not exfoliate and like i was saying i feel like exfoliating is a really really important part of this primer because of the simple fact that it's not so I'm using the Sacha Mattifying Primer with my Fenty Beauty um, foundation. I'm going to do the same thing I did last time, but this time I exfoliated my skin. And let's just see how it goes. I will be right back to like tell you how I look and show you how I look. Hey guys, so off camera I did my face. And now, before I talk about everything else, I just want to talk about the, um, the like foundation and how it's set. I really like, the only thing is, my Tarte Shape Concealer never dries as quick as it did with this foundation on i guess it was because of the primer was too drying still love it though i love the finish i love how matte my face looks how flawless the finish is um i'm just putting on my lashes right now these are my lashes from flooded by row and nina an extra discount so why not use it and for the 14 days um until valentine from february 1st to february 14th she's gonna have discounts that are like out of this world and then for the lips this is the color damn where did i put it this is the color low key from nyx and this is a lip tease so basically it's not a matte okay guys so that is all for this look the final and last step is to set my face with the sasha fix spray that is all for this look guys and I'll see you next time.